Well, hello there. <laughs> Happy blue sky here in the sunny Sioux. Would you look at that? Just look at that. Wow. Hmm. As you probably saw in my little sweep there, <laughs> we have a ship and it's a big one. We got ourselves the footer, Indiana Harbor. And they are just about fully in the lock here. They have a little bit further to go. But uh, yeah, they're pretty much there. Got Argo pulling on me. He's very excited to show off what he found. I feel like that's still pretty bright. Let me just turn it down just a touch. Okay, that's a bit better. <laughs> but while they make their, uh, their way in here, I'm going to kind of turn around and show. Uh, previously, I mentioned that there's going to be a hotel here, here, and over here. And well, so I was walking by. I see they're surveying right there, looking for a corner, it looks like. So if, if where they're digging is the corner, and again, assuming that the new hotel butts up there, it's going to be really close <laughs> to the Longships Motel. And I mean really close. So, hmm. I guess we will have to wait and see on that. But here we have the Owen M. Frederick, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers tug. And I don't know what the barge is called. No name on this side. But, uh, looks like they're bringing in a crane to uh, work on the crane. <laughs> crane fixing cranes. Well, that's a thing. Of course they look quite uh, diminutive next to in Indiana Harbor. But I think a whole lot of ships would, so. Right. Let's take a peek down here. I'm trying to use my big camera more. So I figured use some of that zoom. There is the salty uh, Wesser, the BBC Wesser if I remember right. They are uh, at Algoma there. And uh, Scott Purvis is over there. I don't know if we can see him or not, but uh, which makes me think they'll be getting underway. I have seen the tugs come just to help them reposition before, so I guess the only way we'll know is by, by waiting and seeing. So. Here we have, they're just about stopped. I'm trying to see. Well, they may not have started shutting the lock gates yet. Hmm. I thought maybe we could catch them uh, closing, but or maybe they already have. I didn't hear anything, but I have my headphones in. I normally listen to audiobooks on our walks. I feel like they should go 
A little bit more though. Hmm. Yes, it does feel like you're standing next to a moving building. It really does. That's not an illusion or a trick. <laughs> I think this is going to be a quick one. I've kind of moved my lunches around. I don't know if anyone really cares, but I used to eat first, then walk. And I started walking, then eating. Um, just as a something a little different, you know? <laughs> I'm such a creature of habit. Sometimes I gotta break up these habits just a touch. Looks like they're pretty much still. And of course, here's the good boy who always finds us these ships. He's consistent, that is for sure. Right, dog? Really so interested in. There's a dog barking over there. But that's going to be it for today. So hope you're enjoying some lovely weather. Today and tomorrow is supposed to be great. And then uh, getting back to a little more on the cooler side. So <laughs> we're trying to enjoy it. It's sunny, but that breeze makes it a little chilly. But I'm not complaining. It's quite nice out. So have a great day, and we will be back once again with some more ships.